Copestone Podcast. I can see where you come from, but I know just what you want it from. And what matters in the world's baddest brother, won't you stop it from the drum drum letter? Coach Stone Podcast number 33. I want to thank everybody for listening to the Coach Stone Podcast. I want to thank J.C. Hawks Radio, J.C. Sports Network, and B.J. for letting me do this. If you ever missed an episode of any of my podcasts, you can listen to them on iTunes and Stitcher under J.C. Hawks Radio. Also, remember, go to my website for more information about my podcast, blogs, books, football tips, and free PE games. Go to www.coachstonefootball.com. I also recommend when you go to my website, go to the bottom of the page of my website for promo codes of all the products, I think would help you as a coach or a player. Some you'll hear during the commercial breaks on this podcast. Remember, if you have not seen my books, Back to the Basics Football Drill Manuals, I highly recommend them. They are on Amazon.com hardcover and Kindle. There are five tackle books, one flag book, over 1,600 pages of football drills and content. Without further ado, my next guest on Coach Stone Podcast number 33, Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football and Offense Coordinator at Crestwood High School. Coach, are you on? Yes, I am, and uh, thank you for having me. It's a, it's an honor, man. Oh, stop. The honor's all mine. You know, we should be doing a video cast because we're so good looking, but I don't get exactly. why we're doing a podcast. <laughs> I've got a face okay. for radio. There you go, right? <laughs> um, Coach, here we go. So let's go over the uh, game plan really quick. It's going to be a pregame. We're going to talk about. We're going to let you talk about yourself and everything. Give everyone social media, your followers. Boom, 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 boom. Then we'll, what we'll do is we will then go to the kickoff question, and then we'll have a first drive question. We'll go in. We'll talk some offense at halftime. When we get back from halftime, we will do a kick return question, a second drive question, two minute warning of your words of wisdom, and then after that, if we don't have an overtime. It'll be the end of the game. Does that sound like a plan? That sounds good. Perfect. Coach Ron Mackey, the floor is yours. Tell us about yourself. All right. Well, uh, again, I can't thank you enough for having me on. I don't get to do that many of these, so it, it, it's fun. Um, I am a football coach down in South Carolina. I have always been around football. I've played it in high school. I've played it in college. I've coach now going on my 10th year I have been on the offense and defensive side of the ball but I have always been drawn to the offense I just like scoring points and um, I wanted to be on offense because this is a crazy thing I've always liked the offense right so when I was in college I was one of those guys that I would tell my friends I'm not going to parties because I wanted to stay at home and watch Texas Tech with Mike Leach in Hawaii with June Jones I literally would whip out a notebook and I would draw the plays out as they were happening and seeing what they were doing. That's how nerdy I was. Um, I know you don't have to say anything. That's, that's that's nerdy. I I know it. I know it. I know you're sitting there like, Oh my God, really? You didn't go party in college. You drew plays. You nerd. Listen, coach, I'll tell you this right now. If, If that'll give me more followers on Twitter, I'm all for it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, um, as I was doing football, one night, I have two kids. I have a little girl and a little boy, and this is when my little girl was born. It was daddy's time to put her to sleep. And I put her to sleep, and I wasn't tired. And it happened to be my birthday. And on my birthday, my wife got me a GoPro because I, I coach quarterbacks, and I like to use a GoPro to see what they're looking at so I can see if they're going through their progressions or not. Well, that night, I decided to just put on a GoPro and talk about a one-back power RPO. And I was like, why don't I just throw it on YouTube? Well, that one night uh, three years ago turned into now where I have over 15,000 subscribers on YouTube under uh, Coach Mackey, and that's M-C-K-I-E. I have a pretty popular Twitter, and you can follow me at, I don't even know what my Twitter handle is, Coach Mackey Jr. That's uh, Coach M-C-K-I-E-J-R. And a, a Facebook group that has close to 3.5 thousand coaches on it. It's just a community where we talk about throwing the ball, RPOs, tempo, everything that has to do with spread offense, man. That's the crazy thing about the internet. And because of the internet, I'm sitting here talking to your beautiful self, man. So oh, there you go, God, man. 
stop, stop, stop. <laughs> okay, so so you did that, and then uh, how long have you been the offensive coordinator at Crestwood? Um, five years. I've been the offensive five coordinator years. for five years. Yeah, and it was it okay. was a challenge because when I came in, the school that I was I came into has never run the spread or the air raid or anything like that. They're all wing tee. Then we oh, threw the ball. Love those days, huh? I love those days. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we threw the ball more in one game than they had all year. That is hilarious. Uh, that is so funny. So let's do this, Coach. Before we go any further, before we go to a commercial break, because I really like what we're doing, and we're gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to get you as many traffic to your subscribers, to your listeners, Facebook groups, website, all that stuff. Because you didn't go over your website either. We'll do that later on if that's okay. Yeah, Please sure. tell us again where your Twitter is right now. Give me your Twitter again so everybody can follow right now to it. It's uh, Coach Mackey Jr. Uh, C-O-A-C-H-M-C-K-I-E-J-R. Perfect. And then do your – what is your Facebook? Um, it is facebook.com slash groups slash Ron Mackey football. Awesome. And then, then do your uh, YouTube thing where you have 15,000 subscribers. <laughs> All right, like hold that? on. Don't let me a little plug right there. I do. I do. That was nice. You're making me blush. It is. Hold on. I have it. It's uh, YouTube.com backslash C backslash Coach Mackey. Perfect. All right, Coach Mackey, well, Coach Ron Mackey, what we're going to do is let's go to commercial break. We'll come back with the first question kickoff question and I know a lot of viewers are going to like this question so especially not the wing tee guys but the spread guys <laughs> the guys that run 11 yeah. personnel 10 personnel zero personnel can't wait to hear it we'll be right back coach stone podcast number 33 with coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey football slash office coordinator Crestwood High School we'll be right back do you preach about ball security is getting better each day something you strive to do do you want to work to eliminate fumbles the high and tight teaching football is a revolutionary design football that encompasses virtually every method known to eliminate fumbling, thus maximizing your opportunity to be victorious. The high and tight teaching and training football is state-of-the-art patent football that gives athletes and those around instant audible feedback when you are holding the football correctly, high and tight, thus closing the gap between the wrist and the body and the elbow and the body. Whether you're a player, utilize the wing tee carrying with two hands over the ball or a pro style against their body, high and tight provides an audible alert when proper hold is executed correctly. Start to create habits that win games with teaching your players how to carry the ball high and tight. Order yours today at highandtight.com Use promo code Coach Stone to save. Coach Stone podcast number 33. Just got back from commercial break. Got Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football slash offense coordinator at Crestwood High School. Coach, here we go. Kickoff question. Please tell everybody, what is Coach Ron Mackey YouTube channel all about? Because I want to know 15,000 subscribers. And if you're not a part of it, you're losing out on a great knowledge from a spread guy. Go ahead, Coach. All right, well, uh, I, you just got great knowledge of the spread. I love it. Um, it's it's a place where you can go and talk, where like-minded coaches go, and we learn about passing schemes, running schemes, tempo, any and everything that has to do with spread offense. Because when I was coming up in the coaching ranks, I I had a head coach that really didn't help me out. I would ask him questions, and he would just brush me off. I would go to the – the senior football coaches, I would ask questions, and they would just blow me off. So everything I learned, I had to go and dig through it. I had to dig through forms. I had to go to clinics. I had to – I used my own money to go to those really popular clinics and get those programs. And I didn't like it because there was no one there to help me. So I always said if I got in the position where I could help young coaches just learn, and I'm not saying I know everything. But if I could just share my knowledge and start a conversation with other coaches across the, the Internet, I would do that. So that's, that's what the, uh, the channel is all about. I have videos of schemes that we use. I have live coaching videos where I go. I travel 
in the lower part in the south to different coaches, and we do live on-air um, coaching clinics where I'm interviewing them and going over their program and what they do on offense. I also i am now getting into conversations with coaches through the Internet where I'm sitting at my computer and I'm talking to another coach on his computer across the country, and we got other coaches coming in, asking opinions and stuff like that. I just did one with Kenny uh, Simpson where we were talking about his Find a Way book on building culture, and we had coaches asking, uh, hey, I'm going to an interview. What should I put in my – my packet and Coach Simpson was giving great advice, and it's it's all of that in one little hub where we're just learning from each other, and that's essentially what the channel is all about, man. Just a way for me to connect with smart people, a lot smarter than me, so I can take their ideas and pretend like they're mine. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. That's awesome. So, so with everything with the channel, and you had one three years ago. You said, because you started this three years ago, correct? This channel, correct? Yes. Yes, that is right. Okay. So, and then with that, it just built on to it. And you have a lot of videos, like I've seen in there. I mean, you have, I mean, I came, I would say. I do. What, I have like 100? 130. I have over 130 videos, yes. You know, and and they're from everything. You know, they have some. I see some stuff from Mike Leach, some stuff from other places. And then you have, I see your interviewing coaches, and I see on the chalkboard and things like that. And, you know, the one thing that really struck me, too, and I really like it, and I think we, we, we share a common thing together, is when sometimes when we're at certain coaching, you know, areas of our life and the coaches, like, we want to we want to be a sponge, right? And that's what it sounds like. You want to be a sponge. And it's yeah. tough sometimes because they don't want to give up their secrets. Does that make sense? And I, I think oh, yeah. that's what you kind of totally. said with that. It's, but here's the thing, like, Football's been around for over 100 years now in the NFL. So guess what? You really can't do anything new. Does that make sense? You can modify stuff. You can change stuff. You can tweak stuff. But, like, there's nothing, like, where where there's going to be one guy on the offensive line and everyone else is spread out, right? Like, that's even been done before. You know, so I really like how you're doing that. And if you haven't yet, make sure you go subscribe to his YouTube channel. Just when you go to YouTube, just search Coach Ron Mackey, and it'll come right up with Coach Ron Mackey, Master Spread, co- score points and have fun. I mean, I highly recommend you go in there, look at all the videos. He's got lots of things on there. He's got playlists and all that stuff, you know. So tell us more about it, Coach. Like, 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 do you have stuff that's, like, been, like, always talked about or someone, like, says, hey, they always want to talk about this stuff or things like that? Yeah, well, I um, it started with just me – uh, going over things that I knew, and then I would have questions from other coaches in the comments, or they send me emails or slide into my DMs uh, asking me questions, hey, this happens when we run this play. How would you uh, combat what the defense is doing? And I would go over it. And the good thing about this is I'm learning as I teach. You know, they say that's how you – That's research has shown now that that's the fastest way to, to – get better at something is to teach it because you have to take the information in, you have to internalize it, then you have to turn around and regurgitate it so that someone else can understand it. And when I see these new plays on TV or if I'm breaking down all 22 in the off season and I think I discovered something, I want to teach it so that if there's someone out there that knows it better than me, they can be like, hey, you're close, but it's, instead of X, Y, and Z, it's A, B, and C. And I'm like, oh, crap, that's great. And then I start a conversation with another coach that I'm able to bring on because that coach is knowledgeable. I'm not the one that has all the knowledge. You know, that's something Mm -hmm. that uh, we all want to talk about this great sport. That's why we're in it. It's not for the pay. (laughs) It's because it's an amazing sport and uh, brotherhood, and we just like to reach out and talk. So I, I go over a lot of different things based on what I want to do and based on the comments from other subscribers. Awesome. Perfect. Well, let's do this really quick. Give them the exact thing again, if you don't mind, for YouTube, and then we're going to go commercial break. Does that sound good, Coach? Oh, yeah, that's great. It's um, youtube.com backslash C backslash Coach Mackey. Perfect. Okay, let's do this. We're going to go commercial break. We'll be right back. Coach Stone Podcast number 33. Coach Ron Mackey, Ron Mackey football slash offense coordinator from Crestwood High School. We'll be right back. 
safety of your players is more important than ever. As the game changes to protect the players, TechoTube USA is a leading way with the original innovative product design, not only to practice safer, but promote and teach the best tackling technique. Invented in 2009 by professional rugby player and coach Glenn Remnant, TackleTube allows the players to simulate real game situations, track and tackle a moving target, promote great body position, and improve technique and timing. Coaches in the U.S. and all over the globe are using TackleTube to promote a safer and more effective way to tackle. Unlike other bags that have a limited use, there are many ways to use a tackle tube in your practice, both in season and out of the season. Drills for every position, tackle tube never needs to leave the practice field. Check us out at tackletubeusa.com or on our YouTube channel and all social media. Look for Tackle Tube USA. Coach Stone Podcast number 33. Got Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football, offense coordinator at Crestwood High School. First drive question, Coach. Let's talk about your website. Go. All right, so my website is where I keep every – like I have different branches. I have my Facebook group, my YouTube channel, my Twitter. I have a podcast as well. And I keep all of that stuff in one central hub, uh, ronmackeyfootball.com. You can go. You can – find my videos, you can find my podcast, you can find just random things, the blog articles that I write. Um, I do put out a couple of courses here and there from time to time. It's at that place as well. It's just kind of like my, my little niche of the Internet. Nice. And then, like, give us an example. Like, I know when you go right to your website, you can get some drills. If you just, if you say you want these drills, you can just hit your email and stuff like that. But, like, what do your blogs detain like? Tell us that. Really, right now, it has a couple of articles like inside, what to do on inside zone, how to run the shallow cross, uh, some crazy little thought experiment that I did, like what would you do if you could get rid of your quick game and you just folded it into your run game so your quarterbacks had the, the ability to either run the ball or throw a quick screen or a quick game. And that's simplifying. My whole – uh, philosophy is just to simplify everything. I think in life and football and anything you do, if you can simplify it to the bare bones, you're going to be better than 90% of the people. And that is essentially what this website is about. Keep it simple, small. I always say, people always say, keep it simple, stupid. Keep it simple, small. I love it, coach. And then yeah. you have courses there. What are some courses you have to offer? Um, uh, it, again, the whole arching thing is simplifying. I have simplifying the air raid course, which it's what I did, the offense I installed at this brand-new school that I was at when I first came here. You know, they never threw the ball. They were under center, wing tee, huddle, and everything, and I had to come in. And the offense I wanted to install, I had to scale back even further because they just didn't know the spread, what the pass, and all that. And I put that in a course. Another one is how you can run your entire offense from just one formation. It's the one formation offense. And that and the reason why I did that is because some schools don't want to go full blown air raid. They just want a little package. Well here's a little package you can run that you can run all of your plays from this one package and you know what the defense is going to do because they're seeing the same formation over and over again. That's awesome. I also have one that is just the quick game. Some people just need to simplify the quick game. And I went into how you could simplify it. Hey, you only need these three pass plays and a couple of tags, and you can have a devastating passing attack with while simplifying your playbook and making things easier for your players. And that is phenomenal. And here's what I would say. If you're listening on right now and you're that person, and I'm just like driving, Coach, you're going to be like, going to love Christmas. We're going to love Christmas because all Christmas, all I hear is this. You know, we're looking for drills. We're looking for this. We're looking for that. Yeah. A wing team team is done running a wing team. They want to run spread or air raid. They come to your website. They come to your website. It's right there. You, you just said one formation. What's the formation, Coach? Can you tell everybody what's the one formation that you said? Is it a it's 10 the, personnel, uh, 11 personnel? Well, it, to me, it's 10. It's two backs in the backfield, three wide receivers. And to me – there's two backs. One could be a, a wide receiver type. One could be a running back. And we use motion. So you're in two back, three receivers. But with motion, you can get three by one. You can go two by two. You can 
shift and go five wide, all of that is incorporated in that force. Okay, so you do have like the, the two backs. You have the one back that's like a scat back where you can be a receiver, whatever, yeah. receiver running back. That's why you call it 10 instead of 20. And then your 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 one 10 back is like your true tailback, correct? Yeah, yeah that Perfect. is correct. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, so what we'll do is this, Coach. I see I, – I just went to browse courses, right? So I see when yes, I went sir. to browse courses, I saw Simplify the Air Raid Offense. I got the – Air raid, quick game, like you said, simplifying that. Two back set, one formation offense, and then the power air raid offense. These are courses or books, coach? These are courses, video courses. Courses, perfect. And if you want to go to his website, if you're one of those coaches that are looking to do something with the more passing game, running game, score points, like having fun, like coach says, go to his website. And coach, give us that website again. It's at ronmackeyfootball.com. Perfect. And when you become a member coach, how does that work? Tell everybody about that. Well, I do have a membership, and uh, but the only thing is it's 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 a closed membership. I only open it two to three times a year. Uh, the reason why is I don't want a bunch of members in there because we're it's got a private forum. It has all my courses. I do a lot of behind the scenes stuff with different coaches. They come in and they actually teach us what they're doing. And yeah, yeah. um. I only have that usually at the beginning of the year and then right before spring ball. Okay. So if you are one of those persons, what we will do for Coach Mackey is – Ron Mackey. I'm sorry, Coach Ron Mackey. What we will do is we will put a link so you can find his website in this podcast when we share this out, out to everyone. If you want to become a member, and I guarantee you have a mailing list, right, right Coach? Yeah, I do. I do. I love yeah. email. I, I email yeah. every single day. So, uh, Coach, in fact, let's do that right now. Give us your email so if they want to get on this this private list, spring ball, beginning of the season, go give that to them right now. All right, all you got to do is just go to ronmackeyfootball.com. Once you land there, there will be a pop-up, and uh, you just type your email in. I will send you six drills that you can use in your practice to help you increase your scoring by at least seven points, and then you'll get on my mailing list. And, really, I just talk about football, man. It's all I talk about. I, it's, I've got a, an addiction. Awesome. Perfect. Coach, let's do this. Let's go in halftime. When we come back, i got a great quick kick return question for you. Does that sound good? That sounds great. Perfect. Coach Stone Podcast number 33, Coach Ron Mackey, Ron Mackey Football, slash office coordinator of Crestwood High School. We'll be right back. What legacy will you leave as a coach? The three-dimensional coaching framework empowers coaches at every level to fulfill their transformational purpose by helping them become fundamentally sound, skilled at coaching the mind, and focused on developing the heart. Are you needing to take courses to meet professional development or recertification requirements? If so, check out the different online 3D coaching course offerings at 3dinstitute.com. You can even take the 3D coaching course for three graduate credits. Make sure you use the coupon Unite All to save 10% on your entire cart. That's Unite All, no spaces, all one word, at 3dinstitute.com. The Big Four, a physical education book written by Coach Anthony Stone, can be purchased through the following locations Amazon, iTunes, BarnesandNoble.com, and Kobo. Go Army Edge Football is a free game changing app that allows coaches to draw their plays with X's and O's like on a whiteboard and then get the mental reps from the first person's perspective of any position on the field with real-time 3D graphics or virtual reality. Go Army Edge football comes preloaded with many example plays and drills for concepts such as formation recognition and RPO reads. Any coach in any system can benefit from demonstrating in Go Army Edge football. And every player can become a better football player with extra reps in the app. Go visit them on their Twitter or Facebook. Insert at Go Army Edge. Brian, $30. That's okay, Wendy. That was a good carry. You're still the man. You're the man. Latte. Ah! 
four dollars. Check it out, Johnny. Rub some dirt on it. New piano, three thousand dollars. All right, guys. They're not saying boo. They're saying movers. Supporting your team. Priceless. Sorry, right, Bobby. You still got the best arm in the neighborhood. There are some things money can't buy. For everything else, there's Mastercard. This is VCAP, right? Back from halftime. Coach Stone Podcast number 33, Coach Ron Mackey, Ron Mackey Football Flash, offensive coordinator at Crestwood High School. That's, that's a great ring to a coach. Kick return question. I'm an author. You're an author also. Let's talk about your book, Simplify the Air Raid Book. Go for it. All right. Well, I have a course, the Simplifying the Air Raid course, and I was getting a lot of questions from different coaches. Hey, I want to install the air raid. Never done it before. What do I do? Hey, we're going against this one front. I don't know how to block it. What do we do? And when you keep, you know it, when you keep getting these same questions over and over again, you go, maybe there's something there. So yep. what I did was I just created a book. I've always wanted to write a book. I'm not saying this is a New York Times bestseller, but I, I, I wrote a book. How If I was to just sit down and install the offense, this is what I would do. This is what we did do at the school that I'm at. Um, we've had success with it. And I just put it out there. And a lot of coaches have gotten it, and they've implemented some of the stuff. And I have – it's good when you hear back from coaches and they go, hey, I bought your book. I implemented this concept. It helped us beat our rival. Thank you so much. And that kind of validates your, oh, okay, I wasn't – I do know what I'm talking about a little bit because this person used it, and that makes you feel good about yourself. Awesome. And then how long is the book? So coaches know. Uh, under 100 pages, it's it's a simple read. I am not a an educated man, so I write like I speak. There's pictures. It goes over tags, blocking assignments, words, phrases, all of that stuff. Awesome. And then let's say that if they want to, they can get your course on your website. We already talked about that. If they want to look at this book, how much is the book, and then where is it at, Coach? It, you can find it at airraidbook.com, and it's uh, fourteen ninety five. Perfect. And listen, if you want to run the spread, I'm going to tell you right now, before you buy the book, go to his YouTube channel, look at all the stuff he has, and then you're going to thank me for getting his book. So that's what I would recommend. If, or just pick up the book right now. If you're going from a wing tee, whatever, Coach, they could just use that book and pretty much – do a couple little things to help their offense, correct? They can. They can. And uh, if you go to the page, airraidbook.com, if you go scroll all the way down, you'll see testimonials from coaches that have actually implemented what is in the book and have had phenomenal success. Awesome. Perfect. What we'll do is this, Coach. We'll go to commercial break. We'll come back, and then we'll go with the second drive question, okay? All right. Perfect. Coach Stone, podcast number 33. Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football, offense coordinator at Crestwood High School. We'll be right back. Safe contact, sound fundamentals. Tackle bar football is a safer approach that preserves the tradition and fundamentals of the football game. What is tackle bar football? Tackle bar football is a safer approach to the game that preserves the tradition and spirit of the sport. Players wear traditional football equipment plus a tackle bar harness that holds two foam bars across the lower back. The defender must attract and engage with a proper form tackling technique while wrapping the ball carrier and ripping a bar from the harness. With this approach, players stay on their feet rather than taking the ball carrier to the ground. Tackle bar. Coach Stone Podcast number 33, Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football Offense Coordinator, Crestwood High School. Coach, here we go. Second drive question. And it's not really a question. It's just a statement. Let's talk about your Facebook group. Ron Mackey football over three thirty five hundred followers. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say three thousand plus. I'm gonna say about thirty five hundred now after we we've talked on talked on this podcast. Talk about it. Go ahead. Um, I to me Facebook groups are slowly becoming the online message boards that that I used to visit when I was first getting to coaching, like Coach Huey and things like that. Uh, the thing that I like about it, though, is I can also interact. I can bring coaches on easier to have interviews. Like tonight, I just had Coach Joe uh, 
Silas come on. He's a coach in North Carolina, runs the Air Raid, and we talked for about an hour on Air Raid principles, running the ball, building culture, and all that things just there in front of another group. So it's another way I can and connect with other coaches, uh, bounce ideas off of them. They can bounce ideas off of each other since, you know, there's we're close to actually 3,600 uh, members. And it's just another way for me to connect with people smarter than me, people that love the same game as I do and love doing the same things. I'm all about that connection with other coaches. Awesome. And then uh, who you just had, you said, what was his name? Joe Salas. He's a uh, football coach in North Carolina. For a high school football coach, correct? Uh, hi, yes, sir. Awesome. Perfect. And then do you do, like, tell everybody, like, what you do. Like, do you do these weekly? Do you, like, just call a coach up, the coach contact you? Let's say there's a coach that's right now listening, and they want to be a guest on your show. How does it all come about, or, like, how does it all, like, come into part? Um, it really uh, – I go – I take many different things. I go through Facebook. I go through Twitter. I see somebody that's doing something that I want to know more of. I'll reach out and be like, hey, uh, would you like to do a podcast? And now my podcasts are slowly becoming more um, interactive where I'll do them on Facebook or I'll do them on uh, YouTube, and then I'll just rip the audio and post it on the on the on my podcast. But I've had coaches reach out to me like uh, – just a month ago, Coach Mummy reached out to me, and I had got him on a, a podcast. He wanted to talk about air raid and stuff like that. He liked what I was doing on my uh, YouTube channel. Um, I have talked to Coach Dave Marsh, who's at Texas State. He's part of the uh, Nomazoni tree. I met him at the One Back Clinic, and he jumped on. And Bobby Acosta, who's with uh, Nomazoni and that coaching family. So it's a, it's a way for me to connect and network with coaches that like talking about ball. Because, you know, at the end of the day, all coaches like to do when we go to the clinics is sit down at a bar and just talk ball. And this is a way we can do it without leaving our house because we all have family and, and responsibilities. That's awesome. And then, you know, the biggest thing is I, I love it when, when you can do that. You know what I mean? Or you see someone or someone sees you. Or, like, you know, you have books, I have books. I love it when I go speak somewhere and someone goes, hey, I already bought your first book or I already bought this book of yours. You know, and they say, oh, thank you this or thank you that. You know what I mean? I that, yeah. That's great to do. And I, people always say, hey, do you have time to do this? Do you have time to do this? When I'm at a clinic or I'm at a camp or I'm coaching or I'm somewhere I'm not with my family and my family's letting me be I and I, I make sure they're okay, I, I'll talk for hours. You know, I won't be that coach yeah. where I speak and then I get off. I, I literally, I remember one time getting done at a clinic speaking, and then, like, five coaches are like, hey, we'd like to pick your brain. And I'm like, great. I want to go eat. Let's go eat. You know what I mean? And we just sat at a table, and then all of a sudden we all had, not just them, I had my notepad out. You know what I mean? Because I want to be, everyone can learn from somebody else. Does that make sense? Exactly. And Yeah, it does. You know, the, the biggest thing I would say, and I say this at all the clinics I speak at, please do me a favor. Don't, like, piece stuff together. You know what I mean? Like, this guy is successful here. This guy is successful there. This guy is successful there. Listen, those are scholarship athletes. Or those are big five high schools. You cannot run certain things. You know what I mean? You take oh, what uh, works. I completely agree. Yeah, you take what works, and, like, you see your personnel, and you run it. You know what I mean? You don't, like, try to take wing fee, spread, air raid, and flex bone and put it into an offense. It's not going to yeah. work. You pick one and you go with it. And I think one thing I like, and I've always seen with you, and I'm, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna suggest if you want to, and you can start it up next week or whatever. I, I would love you to just like every week come up with like a question of the week. You know what I mean? Say question of the week. Ron Mackey's question of the week. Boom. And like I'll be like the guy from Mr. Wonderful, like a Shark Tank. I just want like five percent of the proceeds. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. But that's yeah. what I would do because I, I know you do it all the time, right? Like you know, with me. I have my Motivation Mondays, my Technique Tuesday or Teachable Tuesdays, uh, Wisdom Wednesday, you know what I mean, Tackle Thursday, uh, Fundamental Friday, and I do them when I, am, when I have time, you know what I mean, before the football season. Yeah. And then all of a sudden during the football season, it's like doing podcasts. You can hardly do it because you're working all the time. But, like, if we could do a thing, if it's okay with you, you could start a 
you do it on tw your Twitter too and do it on your thing, that would be awesome. Do it once a week. Cause I know I remember I saw one where I think you asked about game planning or something, you know what I mean? And, yeah. uh, or there was something like that. And I like, I think I answered it or I did, or I liked it or something just because like, you know, I have a certain way and everyone does it a great way. And I love the feedback of what everybody said, or I'll chime in every once in a blue moon when I'm like, Ooh, I'll definitely give that up. But like, there's some things you don't ever want to give up. Does that make sense? Cause then, oh, it does. Yeah. Totally. You know, you're putting, you're putting food on the table for somebody, right? <laughs> so if yeah. you're averaging, we were talking in halftime, if you're averaging a certain number of points a game, you don't really want to give up everything you do. Does that make sense? Yeah, so, it does. But but that's perfect. And do me a favor, Coach. Tell everybody again the website. So, I'm not the website. Tell everybody about your Facebook page again. What is like? How would they get to it? Tell them that. Um, all you got to do is just go to facebook.com slash groups slash Ron Mackey. And I think that's it. Let me make sure real quick. But what it, ahead, it's a private fine. form because – yeah, it's uh, group slash Ron Mackey football. It's a private forum because there's a lot of spam out there. And I mean uniforms, uniforms and stuff. You mean or what? <laughs> Good lord, man! <laughs> All over the place. <laughs> and I I want to know that if you're a real person or not. So if you recruit request to join, there's three questions you got to answer. Two of them you have to. The third one you don't have to if you don't want to. And the reason why you have this two questions is it lets me know that you're a real it, it's like my bot check so if you answer those two i approve you and then you hop in and we we've we've got a lot of engagement a lot of people that are bouncing i re, uh ideas off each other it's not one of those groups where you're just promoting yourself over and over again it's actual coaches trying to help one another score a lot of points get better and just really screw over the defense awesome and hey Gotta love that, right? You gotta love that. Exactly. Awesome. Coach Ron Mackey, let's do this. We're gonna go commercial break. We'll come right back with the words of wisdom, okay? Two minute warning. All right. Perfect. Coach Stone Podcast number thirty three, Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football slash offense coordinator at Crestwood High School. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Watch game film, the simple and affordable way to watch, exchange, and manage game film. Watch Game Film has been around for 10 years and works with all sports and all levels of play. Subscriptions start at $100 per team and include unlimited film. www.watchgamefilm.com Coach Stone Podcast number 33. We have Coach Ron Mackey, Ron Mackey Football slash Offensive Coordinator at Crestwood High School. Coach, here we go. Two-minute warning. Words of wisdom. The floor is yours, man. Go ahead. I live with the... The understanding that if you can't teach it to a six-year-old, you don't know the concept or the idea well enough. And what that means is that you have to simplify everything so you understand the nuances, the ins and outs and everything, and be able to teach someone that doesn't know that, but you can still get your point across. And that's what I try to do with all my coaching. Uh, I try to envision that they're just like my little girl, and I'm trying to uh, – to teach her about football, and that's all I'm doing. Awesome. Perfect. And you only did 40 seconds, Coach. That's awesome. Nice. <laughs> so hey, tempo, like baby. That's what I'm all about. I was going to say, with up-tempo offense, we don't even have to go for it. Let's go right to the line. That's how we do things. You know? Exactly. I love it. I love I love it that we're on that at Rockford Boiling. They'll be like, Coach, they know what we're running. I go, I understand that, but they still have to stop it. So guess what? Exactly. Do it, then we'll just run it, and then we'll run it up to it, or we'll run something else to it, or we'll go on too. And they're like, oh, good point. So, Coach, awesome. Yep. That's the end of the game. I want to thank you so much for being my guest on Coach Stone Podcast number 33. From the bottom of my heart, Coach Ron Mackey of Ron Mackey Football slash Office Coordinator at Crestwood High School. Thank you for being on the show tonight. All right, and uh, thank you for having me, man. It was fun. Perfect. I want to thank J.C. Hawks Radio, J.C. Hawks Sports Network for letting me do these podcasts. If you ever miss an episode of any of my podcasts, you can listen to them on iTunes and Stitcher. Look under J.C. Hawks Radio. Also, remember to go to my website for more information about podcasts, blogs, books, football tips, and free PE games. Go to CoachStoneFootball.com. Remember, if you haven't seen my books, Back to the Basics Drill Manuals, I highly recommend them. It is, they are on Amazon.com, hardcover, and Kindle. There are five tackle books. One plug book, over 1,600 pages of football drills and content. Again, Coach Mackey, 
thank you so much. I appreciate it, okay? All right. Thank you, man. Perfect. Always remember, instilling confidence by laying a foundation. Thank you, and have a great day. Coach Stone Podcast number 33. Coach Stone Podcast. I can see.